Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a little review on Morphe's products with Saweetie. So this is the setting spray. I'm so excited because it says Saweet Peach. So I hope it smells like peach. So I'm super excited to try this out. And this gorgeous palette that I cannot wait to open up and look at. It's just been sitting in my drawer and I need to do swatches and try this out and see how this performs so I can play with it more. The 24A Artist Pass by Morphe. That packaging is just freaking adorable. But yeah, before we get into this palette, if you guys are new to my channel and have not yet subscribed, please hit that subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell so you guys know when my next video is. Let's get into this. It's got a nice mirror. <laughs> and you can fold it down. There's the, we're not even showing the prettiness of it. Oh my gosh. Look at this palette. Look at, there's like stars in there. Look at all that glitter. All right, let's go into swatches row by row. Ooh, this is a glitter on top. They're just not on the bottom. Ooh. So we have All Access, which is a gorgeous, gorgeous highlighting shade. My mirror. And then we have Hashtag FOTD. If anybody can tell me what that means, because apparently I'm not cool enough to know what that means. Oh, it's gorgeous. And then we have Wild Out. Look at that glitter, you guys. Oh, my peachness. I love it. And then we have Security. Ooh, that's a good, good matte. Look at that. I love me a good palette. Mm. We have stage persona, which is that purple lilac-y taupe. It's so freaking pretty. There's my jam right there. Okay. The mirror is bothering me. Showing you guys too much in my room and stuff. We have Indio. Whoa. That neon is life right there. Portrait mode. These swatches, you guys. Oh my gosh. I was so... Oh! <laughs> Get the shot. Get the shot. And then we have dessert vibes. Do you see these swatches? And then we're going to go and do this Hugh Mungo row right here. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. I'm so in love right now. We have front row right there, front row. Private Oasis, which is so stunning. Like, it's like a purple iridescent glorified gorgeousness. It's um like a white pearl. And then we have this is so interesting. I it's going to be interesting to play with this. Spotlight Stellar which swatched beautifully as well. As good as like, you know, this chunky this chunky crazy Oh my gosh, you guys, secret set, which is a gorgeous freaking purple. These swatches are phenomenal. Okay, we have max volume, which is that thing right there. And then green room, which looks like my green screen. We'll swatch that one more time. It's not terrible. There we go. Look at that. Then we have Under the Sun. And then we have Ride or Sky. Then we have Major Inspo. Girl. 
Oh my gosh, like what is a girl to do? <sighs> this is such a pretty freaking palette. And now we just have to see how it performs, which I know it'll perform amazingly because Morphe is so good. We have glitter, glitterly, like literally, glitterly. It's glitterly, it's stuck. It's not, it's not horrible though. I'm sure it works good on the eye. Palm tree. See, that one's better. Look at that. Oh, I like palm tree. And then we have invite only, which is another gorgeous color with chunks in it. And glitter you guys use at your own risk. It's technically not safe for your eyes. But I'm crazy and a 90s kid and I've been wearing glitter for God knows how long. So that is Insta Baddie. And of course, this last color, Mic Drop. Yep, Mic Drop for sure, you guys. Look at that. So guys, these are the swatches to the 24A Artist palette. Ooh, that is so freaking cute. OMG, I don't know what to do. I'm so... All right, guys, I'm going to prime my eyes with the Pretty Vulgar Uncaged Eye Primer. We're going to have to do some under eye powder. So, there we have it right there. And I think I'm going to do, like, two things for the highlight because I want to try All Access and I want to try Private Oasis. So, I'm going to go into All Access and... I'm pretty sure this is going to be pigmented. Oh, Morphe. And then I'm going to go into Private Oasis just to like give it a little more like blinding highlight right there. <laughs> Girl, this is your perfect inner corner pop highlight right there. Sorry, I went in with my Morphe JH42 brush to do my highlights, which I always do. I'm going into my Morphe times Jaclyn Hill JH33 blending brush, and I'm going to go into, I'm going to go into portrait mode. I think that is a really good transition shade. And I know this is going to be pigmented right off the bat. So, yeah. It's like a khaki. That's what I call it. Look at that. Instant. I want to go into Indio Woe because I think it is just a stunning orangey. Very bright peachy orange. Yes, girl. Yes. I'm going to go into Get the Shot, which is, well, do I want to go into Get the Shot or Under the Sun? I think I'm going to go into Under the Sun, which is like this neon yellow. And just put that over my crease. Brighten up that orange just a little bit. And then I'm going to go into Major Inspo, which is this like dark purple. And I'm just going to tap this a little bit right there. And you just want to build up that shadow, guys, to where you want it to be. And I love how this peach blends. I literally dipped in the Indio Woe and just blended that purple. I just love how easily it blended and didn't make a mess. This looks a mess, but this is looking good. 
So then I'm going to take my flat brush, my GH41 Morphe Times Jaclyn Hill flat brush, and I want to go into Secret Set, which is this shade right here. You guys, you could do so much with this, and I think I will be coming back on and doing more looks until I get um, my Anastasia palette that's coming in. You can do a gorgeous, subtle look. Look at that purple. Like, you guys. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to go into Spotlight Stellar. Ooh, ooh, you have to be really careful. Those stars get in there. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put the stars on my eyeballs, guys. You want to be so careful. Did you see that star just fall? But look at that. If you're brave, the, the, the stars are falling. Look at that. That is so pretty. So I'm going to go into Indio, Indio Woe, and I'm going to do my lower lash line and, like, connect it. I would just, when you, if you do decide to do the stars, I would just take them off very gently. Just take them off or take a wipe and just blot it off. Um, I heard tape works well for taking glitter off, so you could do that as well. I had to try a look with the stars. Like, they intrigued me. I had to do it. You guys, I'm in love with this palette. You say that every video. So guys, that is my look. I'm going to wipe this off and not look as crazy. And do my liner and lashes in my other eye. And I will be right back. But I am very impressed with this palette. Oh my gosh. I'm in love. I will be right back to show you guys the final look. That's the final look, you guys. I'm so nervous about the stars, so as soon as I'm done, I'm going to take them off with tweezers because it's making me a little nervous. So this little guy was 10 bucks. This palette was $29 and so well worth it. I love it. What do you guys think? I'm going to come up with some other looks, like a neutral look. I'm thinking maybe for next time, and I like the va va boom in your face looks, but not all the time. But I want to. Mm, it smells like peach. Okay, first, because I think the stars would look better, like that. It's enter at your risk, and they're very very chunky, but. It doesn't ruin the whole entire palette. They're not meant for your eyes. Look at that, bitch. I love it. It's gorgeous. And it's Morphe. It blends like a dream. Absolute love. So let's okay, douse myself. I'm scared because of the stars. Give me a nice... Glow. <laughs> I love the way it smells and Morphe's setting sprays are amazing. I have the Jeffree Star one as well that smells like strawberry pez. It's so good. I love that one as well. So I'm excited. This is a limited edition. So I'm excited. So let me know what you guys think. I will come up with some more looks. I had so much fun playing with this I honestly and it probably recommends that you don't put it on your eyes so let me know what you guys think what you guys thought about this video and another one will be coming and I have some amazing things coming your way
Well, guys, I hope you guys liked this one. And also, if you guys are new to my channel and have not yet subscribed, please hit that subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell so you guys know when my next video is. And I always have multiple giveaways, and I will be having some coming very shortly. I love you guys so, so, ooh, so very much.